Hi everyone, I am Miss Thornberry and I'm the teacher librarian here at Springboro Junior High School. Today I'm going to show you how to access ebooks and audiobooks that we have here at school. The first thing that you want to do is to go to my website. The address is www.borrowlibrary.org. Once you are there, you have two options. You can click on the Sora icon on the home page or click on the Sora menu bar at the top. Let's click on the Sora button. Once we do this, it will open in a new tab. We want to sign in with our Springboro Google account. This is Sora. Let me show you around. If you look at the top left hand corner, you can search for a book. I'm going to search for Harry Potter. I just type in the search bar and hit enter. This brings me a list of books that come up with Harry Potter. As I scroll down, I see the covers of books. If it is a plain cover, that is an ebook. If it has headphones, that means it is an audiobook. If you notice at the top, it has some preferences selected. It tells me that I only want to see books in English and available books. If I want to see all the books that are in the library, I can hit the X by available books so that now I can see all the books in the library. Before we check out a book, let's check out our preferences. At the top right hand corner, I see three lines. Let's click on that to go to our preferences screen. I want to add a library. When I click on that, it asks me for what city I am in. I type in Springboro and I see two accounts. One is our school account and the other is the Ohio Digital Library account. Please contact me if you want to add this if you have a public library card. It is really cool. When I am looking at the screen, I see two types of books. Books that are available have a borrow button. All I have to do is to click borrow and I will have checked it out. It even returns automatically so I don't have to worry about turning it in on time. I can also place holds for something that is checked out. Before I do that, I can click on the little clock and it will tell me how many people are in line for this book. If I want to place a hold, I just click on that button that says place hold. It will notify me when it is ready, so just check back. If I want to find out what items I have checked out and have holds for, I can click on the shelf button at the bottom of the screen. Once I click on that, there is a button for loans. This tells you what you have checked out and the due dates. Just click on the cover to open it. Another cool feature is that you can access what items you have on hold and your reading history with Sora. If you click back on the Explore button on the bottom of the screen, this is the home page, which has things organized in list views. Some of these are new ebook editions, genres, and books available now. Finally, please remember that you can read this on many types of devices, Chromebook, tablet, or phone. Your reading progress will sync between devices too. If you have any questions, feel free to reach out to me via email or my website.